for joining me today for another video unboxing. For you now, I have a very special unboxing, at least from my perspective, and it's an Alien Convenant box from my folks over at A-Box. And they were awesome enough to send me over a box for me to unbox. I'm using the word box a lot already in this video. Now, I did go and watch Alien Convenant, and I didn't have high expectations anyway. I was expecting at least to be a decent movie. I found it a letdown. It kind of like shit over the law of the Alien franchise, which, especially the origins of the Xenomorphs, but with that said, I'm still a huge Alien fan, and I've seen much merchandise for Convalent, and it's still awesome, the merchandise aspect that is, and because I'm a, such a big fan still, I've still gone and pre-ordered a movie, the Steelbook version, so when that releases, keep a look out for that unboxing as well, which is going to be a few months down the line. Anywho, to get back to this Alien Convalent A-Box, I've got no idea what's in here, so it's going to be a complete surprise. It arrived yesterday, and I've been eagerly anticipating to unbox it, because I've been busy up until now. So anyway, enough of my jibber-jabber, let's unbox the box! Okay, there you are. Abox.com. Also, I got uh, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter social media pages. Okay, this already, I have to say, it's a very well packaged box. I mean, I, I do get the stuff from uh, from Loot Box, namely Loot Gaming, and I order some extra boxes from there now and again. But this already very professionally packaged. Let's lift this camera up to show you. Correct. Very impressed with that there. It's almost like what you expect to see from a collector's position for a game. That's very tightly packaged. Because obviously if you get loot gaming or you've seen some of them boxings, they're neat in there, but not like that. So that's a good start. I'm impressed with their packaging. Okay, so. Oh, what's in here? Mysterious black box. I'm going for the world, world record for the use of the word box in this unboxing video. So, let's have a look. Oh, we've got various goodies in here. What's this? This item is not a toy. Ah, oh, cool. A set of six pin badges. Wow. Ah. I like them. Let's take these out one by one. Actually, it won't let me. So, it will let me, but it'd be easier, I guess, if I just. It was the right way around. See if we can get an auto. There we go. An Origa 6 badge. USCSS Convenant. Is it Wyland Pin Badge? Yeah, that's obviously the ship they travel on. To the, uh, the planet, so I won't reveal too much about the movie. But, yeah, but uh, ship it over, unfortunate folks, travel on. It's awesome. So we've got another Wyland badge here as well. So that's a great set of pin badges. Obviously, with the loot gaming ones, which I do get the Marvel Collector Corpse one as well. So you normally get, well, Collector Corpse, you get a 9 on patch and a badge. But usually, in my experience on boxes, you get one, ba you get one badge. So... This is six very neat badges. Good start. Okay, let's get this other little box here. Oh, it's a bottle opener. I have to say, look, I mean, the packaging is really good. So I guess if you bought this even as a gift for someone else, if this is uh, the standard of other boxes, this will make a very good gift. Because obviously, if you buy a gift for someone, you always want it to be well packaged. There we go, right. So we've got this is our bottle opener keychain. And it is, of course, of a face hugger. That is fantastic. Sometimes you can get with, uh, I mean, I dare say, with, with Luke Gaming, you do get some cool items, but you do get some items which are quite junky. And one of the boxes I got previously was. Uh, I can't remember what it was the theme of a box, but I got an ice cream scoop, and the ice cream scoop is bust, and even when I super glued it together, it wasn't very stable. I, mean, I, I do have I've had good bottle openers, but this one, it's, that is fantastic. 
that. I really do like that. I'm impressed. Okay, what's it? Oh, is this a cap? Now, this is going to be a tester to see if it fits in my large cranium. So, here we are. We've got the USCSS Convalent Whaling Ship there as well. So, it's officially merchandised. Right, now, this is a tester. Obviously, it's a Velcro strap. I can tell you now, this is not going to fit in my cranium, but. Don't like it being off put because I do have an overly sized cranium. Oh no, no, tell a lie. I can just about squeeze it on. So there you go. So if you've got a large cranium like me, and fear not, this hat should fit. And so I've got a bigger head than most, and it's nothing to do with my ego. Damn my dad. So there you go. It's a nice cap. What's this in here? A t-shirt. But we tell straight away with a face hugger. Oh no. Oh, it's a medium one. Oh, that's a bummer. That's not in my size. I did the uh, state form size that I wear. Oh, gutted. Now, this obviously it shouldn't deter from the quality of a t shirt, but I'm a little bit gutted because I'm not a medium at all. Oh man, that's an awesome t shirt and I can't wear it. <sighs> I have to send him an email. I'm gutted about that because that's a fantastic t shirt. I've got Yanni Confident. Logo on the sleeve as well. It's gone the back. That's a. F oh, why? Why did they send me the wrong t shirt size? Got it. Let's okay, so move the t shirt down. And final item in this box. Oh, no, goes that box. Yeah, I will be sending them an email about that because also I did state my size and that is like. Two sizes at least too small for me, depends on the material. So in here we've got a poseable face hugger. Okay. Oh my god, this is fucking this is terrifying. Look at that. Imagine you had no idea what was in there. That is creeping me out already. That is fucking cre oh, I kid you not. I barely want to fucking touch this. Oh my god. And I'm not even faking this as well. This is fucking terrifying. I'm... As a child, young child, I was scared of a xenomorph. But having a major fear of spiders, these bastard things especially, were a lot worse. So... Oh, look. It's, it's gangly, bony fingers. Look at that. Shit me, man. That is awesome. That is awesome. That's insane. Oh, that could actually sit on your face. Imagine walking around outside of that. Got a long tail as well. Shit. Stand him up. Oh my god. Look at that. Eat your heart out, Luke. Great. <laughs> Shit. And to be honest, I'm not too sure. I think this box is out of 30. I think their sub boxes can be from about 30 quid. You'd never see this in a loot, standard loot gaming box. Oh my god. That is fucking terrifyingly awesome. It's a fantastic fucking almost prop like. That is brilliant. And I think that includes all the items in this box. Um, so, quick recap, we've got a fucking scary as ass fucking face hugger. Got a face hugger keychain. The Wayland cap. Set of six pin badges. And the t-shirt, which is too small. <laughs> so my wife's going to have that one. But all in all, I have to say, this is my first experience with a box, and if this is a standard we can come to expect from them, 
I'm certain I'm very concerned of being a long time subs subscriber to them. So with all that said, that concludes this video unboxing. I really do appreciate you joining me. If you haven't done already, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. That would be mean a great deal to me. And you can also follow me on Twitter at Solidus Snake, the same as my YouTube username. So with that said, thank you my friends and peace out.